it's it's a great class not just for um, uh, the older generation necessarily, but it's great for anyone that just is um, starting to walk out their adult life. And whether you have kids or grandkids or not, uh, it's time to start thinking about who are you going to leave a legacy to and what might that legacy be. A lot of people think that having a legacy actually means financial, but in this class you can actually, um, it's more than just financial. When I heard about the class originally, sometimes you just don't want to think that you're at that point in your life where maybe that's what you need to be talking about. Um, so mm -hmm. that. Um, I would encourage people who maybe don't think that this is the right time for them, uh, that it's actually for, it's for a lot of people. Um, it, it is something that you need to start early. Uh, don't wait till you're a little bit older to do it. Uh, it's important uh, to start as early as you can. It also brought to the forefront, uh, it taught us more biblical principles and how to handle money. Um, we've well, probably a lot of us done investments for a long time, but the biblical side of it. We're all going to leave a legacy. I mean, everybody. There's going to be something here after you die. The point is, were you deliberate about deciding what that's going to be? If you weren't deliberate about it, it might not be what you want. The legacy class helped me to realize that, number one, it's got to be deliberate. Number two, it's got to start now. As Steve said, we are going to leave a legacy. And so to be intentional about that, to reserve that two-hour time um, as a class, you know, to to make that a priority and to work that out, well worth the two hours. It went really fast. Um, not a moment was wasted. It was well timed. Um, it got right down into the to the nitty gritty in a very real way.